Welcome back to our channel where we dive into the realm of discovery and unveil the latest wonders of the world. Today, we're embarking on an exhilarating journey through the most intriguing recent discoveries that will leave you astounded. But before we embark on this captivating expedition, remember to hit that subscribe button and ring the notification bell so you never miss a chance to explore the frontiers of knowledge with us. Now, without further ado, let's jump right into the mind-boggling revelations that are reshaping the way we understand the world. The Lost Golden City The Lost Golden City of Egypt is an ancient city that was discovered in 2020 by a team of archaeologists led by Dr. Zahi Hawass. It is located near Luxor, Egypt, and is believed to have been built by Amenhotep III, the ninth pharaoh of the 18th dynasty. The city is estimated to be 3,400 years old and is one of the largest ancient cities ever discovered in Egypt. It is named Aten, which means, the disk of the sun, in ancient Egyptian, and was built during the time when Amenhotep was promoting the worship of the sun god Aten. The city was abandoned after Amenhotep's death, and it was buried under the sands of the desert for centuries. The discovery of the lost golden city is one of the most significant archaeological finds in recent years. It has shed new light on the life and times of Amenhotep III and the 18th dynasty of Egypt. The city is also providing valuable insights into the ancient Egyptian economy, religion, and culture. Archaeologists have uncovered a wide variety of artifacts at the lost golden city, including mudbrick walls, pottery, jewelry, and even a chariot. The site is also home to a number of well-preserved temples, including a temple dedicated to Aten. The Lost Golden City is a treasure trove of information about ancient Egypt. It is still being excavated, and it is likely to yield many more surprises in the years to come. The Lamborghini Chariot The Lamborghini Chariot of Pompeii is a ceremonial chariot that was discovered in 2020 in the ruins of the ancient Roman city of Pompeii. It is made of wood and bronze and is decorated with intricate designs. Archaeologists believe to have belonged to a wealthy Roman citizen. The artifact is named after the Lamborghini sports car because of its sleek design and luxurious craftsmanship. It is one of the most well-preserved chariots ever found, and it provides a rare glimpse into the lives of the wealthy and ancient Rome. The vehicle is four-wheeled and has a high, arched roof. It is decorated with bronze and tin medallions that depict scenes of chariot racing, hunting, and gladiatorial combat. The medallions are also decorated with erotic scenes, which suggests that the chariot may have been used in wedding ceremonies. The chariot was found in a two-level portico that was attached to a villa. The property was destroyed by the eruption of Mount Vesuvius in 79 CE, but the chariot was protected by the portico from the ash and pumice that buried the city. The Lamborghini Chariot of Pompeii is a remarkable artifact that provides a glimpse into the wealth and luxury of the Roman elite. It is also a reminder of the destructive power of Mount Vesuvius, which buried Pompeii and its inhabitants in 79 CE. Prehistoric Scrolls in Israel, 2021 In 2021, a team of archaeologists from the Hebrew University of Jerusalem discovered a cache of 10,000-year-old scrolls in a cave in Israel. The scrolls are made of animal hide and contain writing in a previously unknown language, and are believed to be the oldest known written records in the world. They were found in a cave in the Judean Desert, near the Dead Sea. The cave was once home to a hunter-gatherer community, and the scrolls are believed to have been written by members of that community. The scrolls are made of animal hide, and they are very fragile. They have been carefully removed from the cave and are being studied by archaeologists. The writing on the scrolls is still being deciphered, but it is believed to be a proto-Canaanite language. This is the language that was spoken by the people who lived in the region before the Israelites arrived. The discovery of the prehistoric scrolls is a major archaeological find. It provides new insights into the early history of the region and the people who lived there. They are also a reminder of the long and rich history of writing in the Middle East. It is still too early to say what they want to tell us, but they are likely to provide valuable information about the early history of the region. The scrolls are also a reminder of the fragility of the past and the importance of protecting archaeological sites. 20 Terracotta Warriors Near Secret Emperor's Tomb in 2022, archaeologists in Xi'an, China, uncovered 20 new terracotta warriors near the tomb of the first Chinese emperor, Qin Shi Huang. The soldiers are believed to have been buried with the emperor to protect him in the afterlife. The warriors were found in pit number one, outside the emperor's tomb. 
They are all in different poses, and they are all wearing different armor and weapons. This suggests that they represent a variety of military units. The army is made of terracotta, and they are very well preserved. They are even still wearing their original paint. This is a remarkable find, and it provides new insights into the Qin dynasty and the life of Qin Shi Huang. The discovery of the 20 new terracotta warriors is a major archaeological find. It is the largest discovery of terracotta warriors since the original discovery in 1974. The discovery is also a reminder of the vast and complex tomb complex that Qin Shi Huang had built for himself. The 20 new terracotta warriors are currently undergoing restoration at Emperor Qin Shi Huang's mausoleum site museum. Additional research will be conducted to gain a better understanding of the ancient military and its practices. The discovery of the 20 new terracotta warriors is a reminder of the rich history and culture of China. It is also a testament to the power of archaeology to uncover the past and reveal new insights into our world. Thousands of prehistoric hunting pits beneath Stonehenge In 2022, a team of archaeologists from the University of Birmingham and Ghent University discovered thousands of prehistoric hunting pits beneath Stonehenge. The pits are believed to have been used by people who lived in the area around 4,500 years ago. The pits were found using a combination of geophysical surveys and traditional archaeological excavation. The geophysical surveys revealed the presence of the pits, and the excavation confirmed that they were indeed prehistoric hunting pits. The pits are all different sizes, but they are all roughly circular in shape. They are also all very deep, with some of them reaching depths of up to 6 feet. This suggests that they were used to trap large animals, such as aurochs, deer, and wild boar. The discovery of the prehistoric hunting pits is a major archaeological find. It provides new insights into the lives of the people who lived in the area around Stonehenge before the stones were erected. The pits also suggest that Stonehenge was not just a religious site, but also a place where people hunted and gathered food. The discovery of the prehistoric hunting pits is also a reminder of the long and rich history of the Stonehenge landscape. It is clear that the area has been inhabited for thousands of years, and that Stonehenge is just one part of a much larger story. The archaeologists are still studying the prehistoric hunting pits, and they hope to learn more about how they were used and what they can tell us about the people who lived in the area. The discovery of the pits is a major step forward in our understanding of Stonehenge, and it is sure to generate further research and discoveries in the years to come. Unearthing the past has never been more thrilling. If you're as fascinated by the mysteries of ancient civilizations as we are, make sure to give this video a thumbs up. And hey, if you're hungry for more tales from the archaeological trenches, don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell. Join our community of history enthusiasts and never miss an adventure into the annals of time. Thanks for watching, and until our next discovery, stay curious.